Can you share any examples of, you know, common pitfalls that, you know, customers might find themselves in when you talk about governance and how do you avoid those pitfalls? Yeah. So the biggest pitfall is, is a lack of centralized visibility and control. Um, so in, in a lot of organizations, the teams are, teams that are adopting cloud services are operating independently. And so you, you may have two teams, you know, one is, one is going to Azure, the other is going to AWS, and they're, they're not really communicating with each other. Uh, and so um, there's no visibility as far as what they're doing. They're getting into the cloud. And um, in many cases, security and compliance is coming in after the fact. They're being brought in late to the game. And, and so they're then having to play catch up with the, the teams as far as what's happening there. But then at the same time, because you have these workloads being put out there the way that they are, there's in inconsistent configurations. The costs end up sprawling because maybe you don't have the right enterprise agreement or contracts with the cloud provider. And then developers are very focused on developing. Like I said earlier, security comes in sort of at the tail end if they're brought in and security vulnerabilities may already be in existence that are going to be harder to engineer out as a result of that. So th there's a few things, Kevin, that you can do to sort of get control of that and get the visibility that you need. The first is to set up a cloud center of excellence or a cloud business office. What this is, is it's a cross-functional team. It's, it's IT and the business. They come together to, to do this and they, they sort of provide that gui guidance. They take the standards that already exist, they extend them for cloud, and then they set those as cloud standards and they define what the usage patterns are going to be for the entire organization. Are we going to go AWS? Are we going to go Google? Are we going to go Azure? Are we going to do many clouds all at once? And so they, they sort of put all of that together for the organization and say, this is how we cloud. 